want you to imagine really quickly that you just achieved your goal, the goal that you've had for a really long time. You finally have a successful business. Minimal stress, maximal happiness. Sounds great, right? What if I told you that right now you're never going to get there? Sounds harsh, I know, but hear me out. Because right now, you're just simply not good enough to build a successful business. Not yet. But you can absolutely get there. You just need to develop three main skills. The first skill is communication. If you don't have clear lines of communication between you and your team, between you and your clients, then everything is going to crumble. You need to establish clear lines of communication. Without it, you can't achieve anything. Now, simply that means, how are you going to communicate with your team? Is it through an app like Slack, which is what I use, it's awesome. Or is it through email? Whatever it is, make sure it's very clear. So that way, when something needs to be changed or there's an issue, or if you're trying to create something, it's very clear on how to communicate and how to achieve exactly what you want. And the same thing applies to your customers and your clients. You need to make sure that it's very clear on how to reach each other because there's so many lines of communication. Facebook Messenger, LinkedIn Messenger, email, Slack, whatever type of maybe software that you're using for your clients, you need to be very clear so that way when they have an issue, they can get to you and you can get back to them. So it's great for both of you. The next thing that you're going to need is structure. Structure is going to equal freedom. Now I know, I know that sounds crazy, especially when I started my business, all I wanted was freedom. But I've really come to realize that without the structure first, I can never actually get the freedom that I want in my life. That means at the end of my workday, I plan out step by step how my next day is going to look. And that includes everything from work to my personal life. That structure makes sure I get done exactly what I need to be done and not feel overwhelmed and stressed out. So just remember that the better that you can structure your days, the more freedom that you're going to have. And the final piece is delegating. Now I know that sounds challenging if you've never delegated anything in your life, but it's so important that what you are actually good at is what you spend most of your time on. So if you know if you're doing a task that someone else could actually do better than you and you could use that time to actually work on the things that are gonna drive your business forward, you need to be delegating those to someone else. Now for me personally, I use virtual assistants for a lot of my day-to-day -day work. Them doing a lot of those day-to-day -day tasks really allow me to focus on what really matters for my business to drive it forward. So you can absolutely build a successful business. I'm not saying you can. It's just without those skills that I just talked about, communication, having structure, and delegation, you're never going to be able to get to where you want to go. But if you do, I can guarantee minimal stress and maximal happiness is in your future.